All right, sunrise, burly heads, moody overcast day, nice foreground, huge swell. Let's get down there and take a shot. So I've made it down the rocks here. Uh, sunrise is in oh, half an hour. I got here nice and early set up. Um, you can see my composition here, this awesome, this awesome black basalt rock here. Uh, down at Burley Heads here on the Gold Coast, uh, all these, see all around me, just these massive basalt boulders you have to scramble down to get here. Uh, obviously from an ancient volcano. Um, the headland itself just sticks out on the coast uh, on uh, the Gold Coast here. It's an absolutely perfect spot for landscape photography. And I read the tide, high tide coming in, smashing this uh, rock here. Well, over here. Uh, yeah, really good to see you guys. Hope you're all awake like I am. Uh, if I spin around here, I've got these other sort of big boulders here as well I can now uh, work with. But at the moment, I'm just focusing on this one right here. This lone little boulder. Uh, ISO's at uh, 150, a little bit still dark in here. Shutter speed's about one second. Um, and F stops at uh, F10. No filters, really gloomy, overcast day, perfect conditions. So I'm gonna fire off a few more shots of this rock, maybe walk around behind these boulders here, and uh, yeah, see what I can get. The problem with uh, this coastline or this point here is these huge boulders you have to rock up uh, very it's it's quite dangerous uh, the fact you got your backpack on and you're literally hopping from rock to rock there's no you can't walk between the boulders here which is the annoying thing actually behind me here on the hill you can't see about two years ago it's here taking sunrise absolutely crap sunrise didn't get any photos gave up walk up that hill there slipped over broke my collarbone so yeah <laughs> Uh, not today. All right, I'm going to take some more shots of this boulder, the Sloan boulder. I'll chuck it up for you and we'll move on to the next one. Uh, 10 minutes off sunrise. I've come around this other side. I was showing you this, this other option I had, this huge shark fin looking um, shark fin looking rock here. Protrudes out, pointing. Uh, real gloomy, as I was saying before, real gloomy overcast sky. We don't really get that here on the Gold Coast. So I watched, uh, I got an app called Clear Sky. It's free, download it. Uh, it tells you the percentage of sort of low, medium and high cloud. Uh, it's pretty accurate. It's a pretty good uh, app, actually. And it said there'd be a lot of, a lot of medium cloud around. You're not getting that high cloud where you get all that pink, uh, beautiful sunrise. But it wasn't after that. It was after these gloomy sort of shots. These, I don't know. I really like this, these conditions. Uh, anyway, I'm uh, focusing just in the little bay here of all these basalt rocks leading out to this huge, uh, what do you call it, shark fin. 
and then this real ominous gloomy sky it's looking really good i'm at 1.3 seconds f16 and iso 100 still no filters which is good i think the sun, sun will be blocked off from any sort of uh harsh light coming in so at this stage don't think i'll need filters got my polarizer in my pocket here uh might have to put on to cut some glare off these uh, basalt black rocks here but i'm going to uh, take a few more shots here um yeah again love these conditions uh high tide coming in so it's bashing against all these rocks in the foreground here surf pounding out there um so i'm trying to what looks better with the water flowing out or crashing in over the rocks I, I think it looks better dragging the white foam dragging off over the black the black basalt gives that contrast yeah anyway i'll take a couple more shots of this one chuck it up and tell me which one you like better the previous shot around the rock background there or this or this rock all right cheers Wow. Okay, wow. So yeah, wasn't much of a sunrise, uh, as I was saying. Real gloomy, overcast day. Uh, so that, back to that, but I didn't mind that. I, knew, I came for that, um, there's uh, like squalls or rain clouds way out on the horizon there, blocking the hori uh, sun. I knew that'd be the case, that's exactly why I came here, one of those real moody shots and I hope they come through in the, in the in the images that I put up yeah so if you're uh never been to Gold Coast and you want to uh want a location want a spot I've done a vlog here before but the conditions weren't right but Burley Heads definitely watch the basalt rocks these big boulders getting down here off the track uh you will will injure yourself if you're not careful uh lots of surfers out a few a lot of shark activity over the last few weeks uh, here on the Gold Coast. Um, so yeah, they're game. Uh, it's probably nearly 6 a.m. in the morning. Uh, this is probably gonna be my last sunrise for 2020. Um, I'll see how I go. Uh, issue with that is, and I've mentioned it before, is we're coming into spring now, uh, nearly summer. We don't have daylight savings here on the Gold Coast. Uh, so the sun first lights at like uh, 20 past five in the morning now, uh, in a couple of weeks, you know, it'll be 4.30 a.m. And I'm not getting up at 3 a.m. to come there and take photos as much as I'd like to. Uh, but yeah, so this possibly could be my last sunrise for 2020. Um, I'll watch the clouds over the next few weeks. Um, if we get some high cloud, I might come and do another sunrise, but yeah, that's pretty much it, I think. Um, yeah, just want to thank everyone, all new subscribers, everyone out there. Cheers, appreciate it. It's what makes me, makes me uh, keep going. Thumbs up, the subscribes, appreciate it so much. So uh, if you like my content or you like this, uh, this vlog, thumbs up, helps me out a lot and uh, yeah. Appreciate it if you subscribe too. And uh, till we meet again on another landscape photography adventure, peace out, cheers, have an awesome day, guys. See ya.